In the years ahead, I will never hold a position higher or a covenant more sacred than that of President of the United States. But there is no title I will wear more proudly than that of citizen. I think I should spend the rest of my life trying to give other people the same set of life chances that I had. At 11 a.m., the party officially begins to help welcome the former president to his new neighborhood. They will officially open today. Former President Clinton is joining the war on AIDS. I want young people to want to see not only what I did with my life, but to see what they could do with their lives. It's a brand new day in America's schools. Kids now are eating differently and find it to be fun. President Clinton has created a forum where we can come together and share our ideas and our innovation. I believe the next 30 years can be the time of greatest discovery and possibility and creativity the world has ever known. Changing the world for the better isn't just someone else's business. It's really up to all of us. The Haitian people are fully capable of supporting themselves, organizing their affairs, attracting their own investment, doing their own work. We just have to build the capacity to do that. Climate change and the consequences of it are profoundly important now in the Caribbean. An actual space where kids can come with their families while they're doing their laundry, borrow books from the library, and we hope that really helps build kids' brains. This is the most interdependent age in human history. But that's going to take enormous amounts of leadership in every sector. In America, more than 130 people die from an opioid overdose every single day. This is a national health crisis, and more must be done. Building a resilient future is not just about preparing for emergencies, it's about reducing the severity of future hits. Thank you for preparing and delivering the life-sustaining foods you all are a part of. Thank you for being compassionate. Regardless of what you do, regardless of how much money you have or don't have, how are you going to do it? You have to believe in possibility. You have to cultivate a culture of possibility. But only if we embrace our common humanity over our interesting differences and get up tomorrow knowing good people committed to creative cooperation have almost unlimited positive impact to help people today and give our kids better tomorrows.